Are you right now at the verge of giving up on life? Do you battle condemnation and feel inadequate? Is there a part of you that doubts whether God truly loves you? Would you like to better comprehend God's love for you? Life is full of uncertainties, but in God, there is an assurance of a beautiful future. Be inspired as you receive God's word that will stir up faith and confidence in the love that God has for you. Join us today on The Covenant Light. Welcome everyone. Good morning to you. Go ahead wherever you are. Worship. Praise God. And then send out the links once again. Send out links to everyone that you can. And let's spread the gospel. Hallelujah. Just couldn't take life anymore My problems had me bound Depression wet me down But God held me close So I wouldn't let go God's mercy kept me mm-hmm. So I wouldn't let go Yeah. 
sweet Holy Spirit because you kept us wherever you are this morning give him praise give him praise give him praise hallelujah wherever you are this morning go ahead and give him all the glory all the honor all adoration oh Take a moment today. I just wanted us to remember. <laughs> if you're going through something, he's still holding you. If you're going through a dark period or season, he's still holding you. And if you've come out of one, he brought you out. And you learn to give him the glory. Father, I honor you. You kept me. Leno si branande ge sida da bayate ke lele kosoto ya bakuru bragade ge soliane krendo bosuto le brahate. Oh, Father, we give you praise. Hallelujah. Lord, we ask you for revelation knowledge to dawn upon our hearts as we look into your word today. In the name of Jesus. We're going to be praying, so let's dig into the word quickly. And get to the arena of prayer. The Lord spoke to me and said this week we should focus on the rewards of mission. And yesterday we we prayed about settings. Settings that God will, the Bible says that you are a city set on a hill. The Bible says that he sets the solitary in families. The Bible says he sets our feet upon the rock. We can see from scripture that God sets people. Set people. There's a setting for you to be able to do the work and ministry and mission that God has called you to. Whatever that setting is, child of God, you are coming into it. Now, after we finished, I just, while I was still on my table, after we finished, I just heard in my spirit another prayer. So I wanted us to move to something else, and we still might today. But I heard in my spirit this statement, every space meant for me, open up. Every, Every place and space meant for me, open up. I felt in my spirit God wanted us to command things to open. Yesterday we spoke to him. Today we're going to speak to things. We're going to speak to things. Hallelujah. We're going to speak to things. And so here is here's faith now. Here is faith. The pro- faith comes by hearing and hearing the word of God. So here is the word of God. Here is faith. God's word says, No man lights a candle and puts it under a basket, but rather he sets it on a lampstand. 
So every person who has been lit by God, every person who has been given light by God, already has a pre-planned lampstand, a setting for you to function. For you to function. You already have a setting. I feel an anointing of the Holy Spirit. And sometimes the enemy comes in and tries to keep the manifestation of this or, or make it a struggle to step into what is supposed to be your placement and your connections and the relationships, the placement and the people. He comes with all kinds of stuff. Sometimes he makes us act in ways that are self-destructive. Sometimes he just simply brings all kinds of attempts to destroy things. So yesterday we spoke to God. We spoke to the enemy. Now we're going to speak to the setting itself. Every space meant for me. Open up. Every space meant for me. Open up. Wherever you are right now, in the name of Jesus Christ, you are going to speak this in Jesus' name. You are going to pray this with fire and with fervency. And we're dedicating today, you know, I had what we're supposed to talk about today. Part of what God had told me we should address this week. But after yesterday, this rose up in my spirit, this prayer, this very statement, every space meant for me, open up, be manifested. And you're going to pray it in your understanding, you start speaking in tongues, then you say it and you speak in tongues, and you do that, you know, and continue to do that. Hallelujah. Continue to do that. Now, one more scripture. Like I said, here is faith. One more scripture. The Bible says, we shared this yesterday. I want to put it in your mind again as you pray today. In Romans chapter 10, the Bible says, from verse 10, for with the heart... One believes unto righteousness, and with the mouth, confession is made unto salvation. For the scripture says, whoever believes on him will not be put to shame. For there is no distinction between Jew and Greek. For the same Lord over all is rich to all who call upon him. So to call upon him. Verse 13 says, For whoever calls on the name of the Lord shall be saved, shall be delivered. Alright, to call upon him is to keep your faith without backing down. To call upon him is to be in faith. Look at it again. Verse 11, For the scripture says, Whoever believes on him will not be put to shame. Believes on him. For there is no distinction between Jew and Greek. For the same Lord over all is rich to all who call upon him. Is rich to all who call upon him. Oh, hallelujah. So there is no distinction. Everyone today who call upon him. How do you call upon him? Whoever believes on him will not be put to shame. Everyone today who takes that stand who speaks in faith and takes that stand today. Every space meant for you. You see, you are occupying a space already because you exist. But there's another space. There are more and more positions and spaces in the course of our lives that God has called us to. I hope you have, I believe you are beginning to speak already and beginning to pray in the Spirit. What an anointing this morning. Hallelujah. Kelly Brahma Hagele Brosh the Kera Dia. Reven also Kora Dia. No Hokora Prahaya. 
Meheko skoro dina mande gele brodo govos kere diya gasketra nande ge sita pa. Mako sita pala mahashke. Ekreto skoro bui. Le prono ho koshe libra mahande. Neheko skere diya kele nonde gezilia. Gevre nonde geleke susofrenot. Meheko sokora bradia. Geboro mohosh kere diya. Neheko ramashanta la braha gezogoro di. Ne kora bragadea gele loso kora dina mahastera nande. Ne eko si pradia. The Bible says in Luke chapter 18 and verse 7, after Jesus had told the parable of the widow who came, kept on knocking, kept on knocking. Then he says in verse 5, Yet because this widow troubled me, I will avenge her, lest by her continual coming she weary me. And the Lord said, Hear what the unjust judge said. That's the unjust judge, not God. An unjust judge could be turned by importunity, by refusing to back down. And in verse 7, he says, And shall not God avenge his own elect, which cry day and night. Can you see that calling upon him again? Which cry day and night, though he bear long with them. I tell you, he will avenge them speedily. Nevertheless, when the Son of Man cometh, shall he find faith on earth. So it was faith. The crying day and night was about faith. The calling upon him is faith. That faith that refuses to back down is like the widow knocking. And he said, the unjust judge had unjust could be turned, how much more a just God. Child of God, rest in your confidence. That what you're about to decree this morning is happening already. Hallelujah. Oh, glory to God. Father, in the name of Jesus, we thank you for your leading. We thank you for what you have have planned and in store for us. In the name of Jesus Christ. In the name of Jesus Christ. Today we've come as your children, boldly to take what is ours. And we give you praise. Now, I speak to every space, every relationship, every space, every placement, every relationship, every person that is meant for our setting, that is part of our setting, be manifest. Every space open up. Every placement be manifested in the name of Jesus Christ. Every connection be made in the name of Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. Go ahead, child of God. Pray with a fervency, not just in the spirit, not only in tongues, but speak and command and say it over and over with faith in your heart. Every space That is meant for me. Open up in the name of Jesus. Every space, every every space, every placement meant for me. For everyone and anyone under the sound of my voice. Open up in the name of Jesus. Open up in the name of Jesus. Open up in the name of Jesus. Maliga mashandala brahashe. Rekopora bahase keradie. Rekebosora manda gabashantala baye. Makose liga maske lanande. Lekopra dia gabahasha. Maria kopra nande gezida bala mahai. Mareboshe kere dia la mahasha kataya Reko kora prategele brosh kore dia Rehe kola brahaya Leke progodo sokoro brohosha kara dia Remo kora brahmahash kere dia Rehe kora bragades kere dia la mahasha taya Lika moso tora brahashe kere dia Ele nondre gezeli brahasha Leiga mosha nananda Lehe mosho kora bahas kere dia Reboso Kora Dia, Nehe Kora Brahaya, 
Leheko pranande geshida ba. Makusa talia brahaya. Reheko skora dia galanande geskora dia. Reheko rakrati krado boskora dia. Reheko prodogo skora nante geshida mahasha. Mali braga dezege brogodo seketeria bakasa. Leko sokora mahasha taya. Lika moskora nande geshida. Mali kamoshida baya. Ne kose li kata krano kos vregedo skora dia. Leno os katrana mande. Lemo okro dubagahaya. Lehe ko shara dia. Ne kolo moho koseria nande. Oh glory be to God. There's a statement. A, 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 a statement made by John the Baptist. That's rising up in my spirit. He has faith now. He has faith. He told the Pharisees and the Sadducees and the people as they gathered to him. He said, and verse 9 of Matthew chapter 3. He said, and think not to say within yourselves, we have Abraham to our father. For I say unto you that God is able of these stones to raise up children unto Abraham. And why did I read this scripture to you? I want you to see what God is able to do. God could raise up stones. <laughs> God could raise up stones to become the children of Abraham. Whatever has to happen. This is your prayer. Whatever has to happen. If God has to raise up a person to replace the one that is there just to make a way. If God has to raise a door where there is no door. If God has to create a role where there is no role, in the name of Jesus, it is happening for you. In the name of Jesus, a way is made for you. In the name of Jesus, your place is delivered to you. In Jesus' name. Now, here's your prayer. Whatever has to happen for my placement, and the relationships of my destiny to be delivered to me, let it happen in Jesus' name. Whatever policies of the government, whatever decisions in high places, whatever decisions Whatever has to happen, whatever decree has to be made, whoever has to be created, whatever has to be created, whoever has to step aside, whoever has to come into play, in the name of Jesus, let my space and my persons and relationships be delivered to me speedily. Everyone under the sound of my voice, let your place, your setting, be delivered to you speedily. In the name of Jesus. Le cosa malama kanda la baye ketora braye. Mele grenon de gesidia. Malia non de gesharaya. I'm not giving up. I'm not backing down. I'm not giving up. I'm not backing down. There's something about that right now in the realm of the spirit. There's something the spirit of God is saying to someone. Don't give up. Don't back down. That woman in Luke chapter 18. She kept on going to that, that unjust judge. The unjust judge is not God. God is just. But he was saying to us, even an unjust judge, someone who is not just, could be swayed by importunity. Could be swayed by someone saying, I will not let go. I almost let go. I almost gave up, but I'm not giving up. I'm not letting go. God said, and so he is doing it. God promised he is fulfilling it. God said, no man lights a candle. And puts under a bushel, but rather sets it. I am set. I will not back down until my setting is delivered to me. 
my placement, my lampstand, my stage, my platform. Let my platform be delivered to me speedily in the name of Jesus. Let your platform be delivered to you speedily in the name of Jesus. Marabaka shataya bakosa. Marabakora brahasha. Marebogo solia brahmande. Remoso kora pataya mande. Imande gele brosho kora braye. Maribaga sataya la mahande. Le kora pratege bosha. Reke boso kora bahasha. Ramasande le brogo disba, 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 disba. Legenon so keredia. Malieno hos patari anande. Malieno hos patari anande. Malieno hos pa. Tereno hos pa. Tereno hos pa. Remoncre do longra de ligra da guspo. Kerato. Prokoto zo pronogo de zegele progodo jaga. Oh bala bahaza. Baske la basko tora brayeka. Le non skedi. Ne non skedi. Ne non skedi. Palu skedi. Gredo progodo shataya mande. Oh rabahasha kata. Le mosca rabanande gele dinama ande le brox celebrayate. Le ne kelia vai. Le ne mahakora brahaya. Le mahakora brahaya. Le makora brahaya. Marabashata la bahaya. Le moso kora dia. Somebody listening to me. There's a word in the spirit. There is a sound in the spirit. It's the sound of importunity. It's the sound of that refusal to back down. That refusal to take no for an answer. That refusal. That is the cry of the Spirit. That's what the Spirit of God is saying to somebody. Don't back down. Because God has spoken. No man lights a candle and puts under a bushel. I have received his light. I will not be put under a basket. No, I'm taking my stage. I'm taking my platform. I'm mounting my platform. I'm mounting my platform. Somebody, as I'm saying it, be saying it. As I'm saying it, be decreeing it. I'm mounting my platform. I'm taking my place. I'm taking my platform. I'm taking my place. Maraba shante lebosha. Maraba kora bagaseliana. Saliana. Toba kazelia mande geria bakosa tai. Mali braga da bagabala mashanda la braga bora bayakela brononda. Sikele bo kalia mande libra hai. Maria bakora bayakela na mande. Everyone under the sound of my voice. You're taking your place. You're taking your place. You're mounting your stage. You're mounting your stage. You're climbing that stage. You're climbing that platform. You're standing in your place. You're connected to the right people. You are shining forth the glory of your Father. Marie Bagashata. That place that you are meant to stand to shine. In the name of Jesus is delivered to you speedily. Those people that are meant to see your light. You are connected to them speedily. In the name of Jesus. Salalamotha. You won't give up. You won't cave in. You won't quit. You won't back down. Uh uh. Uh uh. Uh uh. Palapa sakala posoko to rabahasha. Reposo kora braga de gede 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 go brayada. Baraba go seke rebo kosoto rabrahaya. Reketo poro bohoya. Nehekora prategele brohosha, eleketo salamahaya, and he spake a parable unto them to this end, that men ought always to pray and not to faint, saying there is there was in a city a judge which feared not God, neither regarded man, and there was a widow in that city, and she a widow, no husband, no one to back him up, back her up, no one to speak for her, the widow. Is the weakest person. She's a lady and she has no husband and she has dependents possibly. She has no one to stand for her. In that time and day, the worst thing to be is a widow. The least in the city is a widow. So Jesus said it was a widow that came. He wanted us to see. You are never without help if you know how to pray. And she came unto him saying, Avenge me of my adversary. And he would not. Because he's unjust. Because he has no regard for man. 
he would not. The one who would not eventually had to because somebody refused to give up. How much more God? But afterward, he said within himself, Do I fear not God, nor regard man? Yet because this widow troubles me, I will avenge her, lest by her continual coming she weary me. And the Lord said, Hear what the unjust judge said, And shall not God avenge his own elect, which cry day and night unto him, though he be along with them. I tell you, he will, not in might, not in could, he will avenge them speedily. Nevertheless, when the Son of Man cometh, shall he find faith on earth? Shall he find someone who is refusing to back them? Who in faith says, I'm not giving up. I'm not caving in. Oh, hallelujah. Just take a minute or two more and just continue to decree. I will not back down. I will not cave in. I will not quit. That place where I am meant to stand to shine my light be delivered to me speedily. Those people that my light is meant to shine upon be connected to me speedily in the name of Jesus in the name of Jesus in the name of Jesus Marabazagabragadegebosha Malagamahasha I want you to be that person that person that's shaking the head and said I don't care what you guys are saying I don't care what you guys are saying I'm mounting my platform I'm taking my place I am connecting with my people. That person is shaking the head and saying, it doesn't, when you guys have said what you want to say, you can, you, can, you can go back home, you can go sit down, you can turn back, but I'm not, I'm not walking away from here without this. Because no man lights a candle and puts under a bushel. No man lights a candle. Ah, no man lights a candle and puts under a bushel. No man lights a candle and puts under a basket. You will not be hidden. You will not shine under the basket. You will not be covered up in the name of Jesus. As I'm saying it, it is happening. You are mounting your stage. You are mounting your platform. You are taking your place. You are taking your place. You are taking your place in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. 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 You are seeing it. You are taking it. In Jesus' name. Father, we give you praise. Lift your hand and praise him. 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 Bless the Lord. Bless the Lord. Father, we praise you. In Jesus' mighty and precious name. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen and amen and amen. Child of God, that's the sound of the Spirit this morning. I couldn't even teach. <laughs> but that's the sound of the Spirit this morning. Don't back down. Don't give up. Don't cave in. And keep your faith right there. And keep saying it. I'm mounting my platform. I'm being connected to the people who are meant to see my light. And I am taking my place. In Jesus' name, amen. Hallelujah. Thank you, Father. It is done. Let me release my faith. Father, thank you. Everyone under the sound of my voice. We are mounting our stage. We are taking our place. Every space meant for us to stand and shine is opening up to us. In the name of Jesus. And every person that is meant to see our light and to aid our light is connected to us in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Thank you for joining in. Don't miss tomorrow. It's going to be awesome. Do have a wonderful day today. Remembering you're loved by God. It's unconditional. And because of it, you are walking in his wisdom. 
his power, and his favor. Have a wonderful day today in Jesus' name. Amen.